Crikey apologized to Brittany Higgins and resented her readers over an opinion piece one of her top journalists. In an article by Guy Rundle titled, The Brittany Higgins Case We Don't Need to Declare Our Brains In. Security entry, he fired Ferrore online after demanding that the settlement paid to Brittany Higgins be made public. The newscast decided to remove peace over the false statements and tone of article. Guy Rundle's article contained two errors and did not meet Crikey's journalistic standards. Ms. Higgins called the article disgusting. NCA Newswire Gary Ramage We apologize to Brittany Higgins and our readers and will update you on an ongoing conversation about this. Crikey's editor said in a statement. The first issue with Peace was the claim that consultation process for Brittany Higgins. Compensation was strikingly quick. This is not true, Higgins secured his claim in March 2022 while the Morrison government still in office and it was not resolved until December 2022. Seven months after the current government elected, he said. The second false claim was that the amount paid to Ms. Higgins was believed to be 3 million inches. Ms. Higgins said the figure wasn't close to 3 million, calling it just wrong and threatening legal action against media outlets that repeated that figure. There is no real basis for 3 million figure. Higgins said the figure was his first claim but final figure was much lower than that, Higgins said. In addition to these factual errors, the tone of the piece did not meet Crikey's journalistic standards, given that it was most relevant to writing about sexual assault allegations. Miss Higgins responded to the article by raising a specific issue with the title. Craving but disgusting, he said on Twitter. His partner. David Shiraz, also slammed the piece, and asked Crikey's general manager, Will Hayward, would this victim be happy to have the accusing bile on your website? Mr. Hayward replied to Mr. Shiraz saying he was not good with the part. We want to apologize unconditionally, he said. Hundreds of Crikey's readers took social media to condemn the publication and shared that they have decided forego their 200 a year subscriptions. The tweet that lost a thousand angry subscribers. Said one reader. I just cancelled my subscription. The 199.00 you can't get from me in August I am not paying for this kind of crap, he said.